Hello everyone, welcome to today's lecture video. In this video, we are going to see minimal word pairs and contractions. First, let's look into minimal word pairs. What are these minimal word pairs? A minimal word pair, word pair uh, has only one sound differing from the rest of the sounds in the letter. Okay, what is a pair? First, pair is a two sets of uh, a set of word is pair. So those two words have only one sound differing. The rest would be same. That is called minimal word pair. For minimal word pair, the definition is uh, differing on various grounds. But the basic rule for minimal pair is uh, mm, only one sound must be differing. The others are same. Okay. Take for example, fan, when. Okay. Here. A in a in they are same sounds only one sound is differing that is f and f. okay this uh, a sound differ a differentiation can happen in the beginning or in the middle or at the end of the word take for example desk disc in the first set we have in the uh, the sound was differing in the beginning but in the next set the sound is differing in the middle okay so let's go and check out uh, the minimal pairs okay minimal pair number one in this we have only i and e sound differing the other sounds must be same take for example a sit seat okay here the first sound is s and in the next sound is t okay and uh, here look at this so we you have three sounds here s, e, it. and here again you have three sounds s, e, t. the uh, first and the last sounds are same only the middle sound is differing okay e and e so this is the mini uh, okay c it is the minimal pair for sit okay here sleep and slip okay here again you have four sounds in each letter s l e ip and s l ip okay so uh, here only one sound is differing that is e and a others are say sheep and ship so this is called minimal pair let's go and check out every minimal pair okay possible in english minimal pair number two a and e desk disc look at the don't check out the letters only the sound must be differing not the letters here the letters are same that's fine in some cases the letter will be same do not check out with the letter because you will go wrong sometimes only check out with the sounds okay and then in the first pair we have a and e differing lead okay sorry let okay it's a thing metal lead and lit <laughs> the first sound is l a d and the again here the first sound is l e and it let lit next one a and a wet wait okay eight bit bait only a and a is differing in these pairs uh, minimal pair number four a and a bat but okay bat but it may not be rhyming but the thing is uh they have only one sound differing the other sounds are same ankle uncle okay ankle uncle angry hungry okay next one ow and o so so this is not so this is so and next one minimal pair number six a and o not note not note next one a and a bad bed mat mit okay a a uh, fast first short shirt 
a and a okay a and a had hot you guess any of the minimal pair for this sound and then o and o caught hot 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 this is small o this is long o and o ow no now and of berry 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 only these sounds are differing b and f and by pi by the spellings are completely say, different but the pronunciation is same okay by pi next one contractions okay um in english we have something called contraction or in other words it can be called as short forms of a word of a word we saw strong form and weak forms it is almost similar to that okay what are contraction the words will, the letters will be reduced how contractions are shown by removing a certain letter you replace an apostrophe uh, for the uh, removal of the letters okay take for example when you remove a from from am you a uh, replace a with an apostrophe am okay or a is removed you replace it with an apostrophe or is a contracted form where okay we are okay it is here or is contracted they are here or is contracted and is and has can be contracted as apostrophe yes take for example yes she has its next one have can be contracted as apostrophe we have you have they have we have will can be contracted as apostrophe ill you will they'll he'll she'll it'll we will okay had and would can be of uh, contracted as apostrophe mm. apostrophe d it will be pronounced as id, id you'd he'd she'd it'd okay and then contractions with auxiliary verb and not as we saw in uh, question tag it is very sim it is similar like that as we contract the um, auxiliary verb with not for tags we do that in construction orient okay or plus not orient can plus not cannot could plus not could not did plus not did not or didn't okay and then has plus not hasn't how plus not haven't is plus not isn't he isn't she isn't must plus not mustn't shall plus not shan't should plus not shouldn't okay other contractions are possible in english how contractions can occur after names nouns okay uh here there now okay after question words contraction can happen anywhere these contractions are not considered appropriate in formal writing because Contra whenever you use contraction it is informal way of speaking or writing so it is very informal with whom do you use contractions with your friends with your uh, uh, the, with kids or with the people who are younger than your age not with elders or not with the people who are in higher position than you it will be considered as informal and uh, very rude sometimes okay look at this contraction here my sisters uh, my sisters got married here it means it uh, this apostrophe uh, yes means has my sister has got married how do you identify this is has by looking at the tense okay john will be very happy we don't use contractions um two contractions in a sentence okay either you use one in you have to use only one contraction in a sentence so that is the end of the video so i hope you it is a very easy concept to understand you understood very well if you have any doubt please ask ask me and more details about this concept is available in lecture notes you can always avail that for your uh, clear view about contractions and